sketching for your coil pot vessel. You're going to begin by opening Adobe Draw. We're going to select a new project and choose the letter portrait format. Before I get started with my sketches, I'm going to go ahead and bring in my coil pot checklist. So I'm going to grab from my iPad this little reminder and I'm going to put it right in the top corner. So I have to remember that I need my coil pots to be at least six inches tall with a three inch diameter base. In one area it needs to expand, so get wider. In one area it needs to contract, so get smaller. And I need to include one decorative coil or cutout. So what we want to do is begin and sketch three different ideas. So I'm just going to choose my black brush and what I might begin with is I know that I'm going to have a three inch round base and maybe my first idea is for it to kind of belly out and then get smaller as I get to the top. So maybe I have this kind of almost bottle like shape. Now I'm going to go ahead and zoom in. So I need to show exactly what my coils are going to look like in this project. So maybe I stack. Here is where I'm going to expand. Here is where I'm going to contract. This is my three inch diameter. It's going to be six inches tall. And I might add some decorative coils closer to the neck. So maybe I do some spirals there. Maybe I also do some spirals down here as well. And then stack my straight coils on top of that. Again, repeating my pattern here until I have a nice little neck at the top. This would be the example of one idea. Another idea, I might start with a three inch base again, and maybe this time I go out, in, out, in. So maybe I'm kind of curving and making kind of like a wobbly shape. This time, maybe I include some cutouts. So maybe I go ahead and create some flowers in slabs and I go ahead and I tuck them in between my coils. So maybe I have some flowers and then what I do is as I stack my coils, when I get to here, I would piece in my flower and then wrap my coils around. So I would fit them in and build my coils around like this. This again would be at least six inches tall. So I've hit all my requirements there. Now for my last idea. Maybe I get really adventurous and I try to create a coil pot that has a, again, three inch diameter base, but maybe it really fans out, almost like more of a bowl shape. And maybe I get a little bit more geometric, so maybe I create some triangle coils for my details. I really like that. And then maybe I reverse them. So I have this kind of band of triangle coils and then stack my straight coils along there. So these would actually wrap all the way around. If I could see through to the other side, I would have all the way across. So this again would be six inches tall. So each one of these ideas has 
expansion and contraction has a three inch diameter, is at least six inches tall, and has some sort of decorative element, whether it is a cutout or a decorative coil, you can see that detail is added here. Once I'm done with my ideas, I'm gonna go ahead and click the upper right hand corner, and I'm gonna share this image to my camera roll and submit it in the sketches assignment.